guys, it's Caitlin, and today I went to a makeup clearance sale. So I'm going to be showing you guys what I bought and how I use it. But before we get started, um, I would just like to say that I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in ages because I have been really busy and my mom's camera broke, so I haven't been able to film or upload. But yeah. By the way, this video is actually being filmed on my iPhone, so sorry if it's got bad quality, but let's get started. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to show you guys what I bought, and then I'm going to show you how I used it. So the first thing I bought was this um, mascara, which is like, it says... Big Eyes, The Falsies, and it's by Maybelline. don't know if you guys can see that. But, yeah. So, I have this really cool, um, it has this really cool looking thing, which is like pink up here and black down here. And this, this part up here is for your upper lashes, and this part down here is for your lower lashes. I also bought another product from Maybelline. Which is this baby lips, um, lip gloss slash lip balm, which is from the Candy Wow brand, and it's mixed berry. It's a really cute color as well, like, it's really cute. Um, I bought another thing from Maybelline. In fact, I think most of this stuff is from Maybelline. All of this is from Maybelline. Um, this is from the Big Eyes Eye Studio, so the same brand as this mascara, and it's like this cute palette that, for, of eyeshadow, which is really cute. It has all these colors. So yeah, I also bought this um, blush, which is from the Fit Me area of Maybelline. And it's a really cute soft pink blush, which I think is super cute. And the second to last thing I bought was this Dream Matte Mousse Foundation, which is um, quite a light shade, as you guys can see. And that is because I have very pale skin, even though it appears quite dark on camera. Not really dark, but quite dark. And the last thing I bought, which is from the Superstate Better Skin area of Maybelline, is this concealer, which is quite a small bottle of it. But I don't use concealer that often. In fact, I don't use makeup that often. Anyways, that's... All the things that I bought from this makeup clearance thing at Mighty Ape, and oh, my nose is it too. And now I'm going to show you guys how I use it. So yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys how I use it. And the first two things I start off with, if it wasn't obvious, is my concealer and my foundation. And I always start off with my concealer first, or that's how my mum taught me to do it. Nice job, mum. She's over there. Um, she doesn't want to be in the video, so yeah. Um, so I, I, I use my concealer first, and I just take a little bit of concealer and pull it back on it because we don't want it going everywhere in case I squeeze it. And then I take it, and because I don't have many things that I need to cover up. Oh, my hair is annoying me. I normally just put it under my eyes where I have my under eye circles because I don't get much sleep. It's school holidays, leave me alone. But yeah, so I just put it under my eyes. I'm like. <laughs> I just. Rub it in by dabbing it with my finger. I just had to do that. I said dab, so. And 
it looks like it's out of place, but it won't once I put my foundation on. Why is my mascara? It's really good. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more on this side. But as you can see, it's harder to see the under eye circles that I had before. And so the next thing I use is my Matte Mousse Foundation. So. So open it and it's really creamy and like moussey. It literally feels like I'm touching mousse. But it's quite a nice light shade. And I just dot this all over my face. So. Like I said, this should look like I have the measles. And with this mousse foundation, it goes on quite smoothly. So you don't have to put on a lot. And it's nice how it just blends in super easily. So me. Sorry, um, we have music playing in the background. And once you have it, I'm just gonna add a little bit more. Uh, that's a lot. <laughs> Didn't mean to add that much. It's enough here. I'm quite new to makeup as well, so this is probably the second time I've done this routine. Because I did it in the car on my way home while we were getting lunch. And once you've blended in really well, it, your concealer won't look out of place. And will look like this. Should look like that. And then I, the next thing that I do is actually my eyes. So I start off with eyeshadow before I do my mascara, and I'm just going to open it. That's what it looks like, because it has the light shade, a nice rose goldy kind of shade, a bronze shade, and a dark brown shade. These two shades just here, the bronze one and the dark brown one, I don't use. But I, first, things I, first shade I take is the one in the middle, just here, which is like a nice creamy colour. So I just take a little bit of that. And what I do is I take it over my whole eyelid and up to my eyebrow. So you guys get to see me do that. Like that. Except I'm gonna add a little bit more. And I'm just going to do my other eye. And then, after I've done that color all the way up to my eyelid, um, I, uh, brow bone, I take this rose goldy kind of color, kind of soft pinkish. And I take some of that, which looks really nice and pretty. It's this one just here. This one just here. It looks really pretty. And I take that and I only put this one on my eyelids. And what I do when I do this is I take my eyelids and I just take them to my bottom ones. And this sort of makeup routine looks really nice and natural. Um, like, it doesn't look too bold. It's really nice for, like, going to school, work. Not that I'm allowed to wear makeup to school. But, like, going to work and stuff. So, yeah. It's nice. And then I'm done with my eye shadow. And next I move on to my mascara, which is this one, as you guys saw. And the first one I do is my upper lashes which has a nice big brush. This is like the tube of mascara, which is I thought was really cool because when I first opened it, I thought that this part would be the brush and that this part would be the tube for both of them. But it appears it is not. So yeah, 
I just threw my mascara as any other person would. I mean, I do my lower lashes. What I find cool about this is the size difference in the brushes. Like, that's my upper lashes one. Like, it's really nice and full. And that's my lower lash one. It's really tiny. So, I'm just going to put my upper lash one away. It's really cute. I don't put a lot of mascara on my lower lashes because I have quite long lashes, but... And it also looks kind of weird if you put too much on. There we go. And that's my eyes done. And then the next thing I do is my blush, which, as you saw, was this really soft pink sort of color. And it comes with this little tiny brush, which is adorable. But yeah, that's the color that it is, which I think is really cute. And yeah, let's just grab a bit of that. Let's put it on, so let's put some on. I just go in circles, and then I drag it out. And it appears like you just have natural rosy cheeks. I might just put a tiny bit more on the side. And last but not least, to complete my makeup routine, I do not wear matte powder, sadly. I don't need it. This is matte. Most stuff normally is good enough just to fit it. But I take my baby lips, lip balm, lip gloss, in this cute shade. And this is the shade that it is. Like, it's a really nice, like, pinky purplish. I put it on my lips, obviously. And it has quite good coloration, like if you can see the color difference. Oh, I like this song. And that's my makeup routine with all of my products complete. So yeah, I have... These are the products that I ended up using, which is this one. I don't know if that one doesn't stand up, but this one, this one, my matte mousse foundation, soft mousse, matte mousse, matte mousse foundation. And my Big Eyes eyeshadow palette. And last but not least, my Fit Me blush. So, yeah. That's my makeup routine completed. Thank you for watching my video today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. And comment down below what you guys would like to see for my next video. I think I might be doing a I might be showing you guys how I clean my room and stuff but I might do that once my mum's camera gets fixed because that would be a lot easier because I have a tripod for that but anyways that's it for today's video guys um yeah leave a comment down below if of what you want to see leave a like if you enjoyed please and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel down below. There should be a little red button. And yeah. Bye.